What is up guys? Happy International Women's Day. It's time to react to The Mandalorian Season 3, Episode 2, Chapter 18. I have no idea what it's called, but got this Boca Tan helmet on a pretty good discount, and it is hands down probably among the best helmets that Hasbro have ever produced and so i just wanted to open with that because it's so freaking cool man um but we're pulling up disney plus here because we are heading to the former capital city of sindari the former capital of mandalore so that din Djarin can journey underneath the civic center and hopefully be redeemed um and return to the watch we will see how it goes this is a long episode so we got to get through it here i'm excited to get into it with you guys i can't wait to see even the remains of sindari in live action one of my favorite locations in all of star wars from the clone wars and i i just it's gonna be so cool um and i think bloke is probably in this episode too so here we go okay got a local land speeder race well, I don't appreciate tone boys. John Favreau oh, really so loves this character. <laughs> Him and Dave are big oh, Amy no, Sedaris fans. You, yeah, well, me? You know, I do have a life. Hurry, like a nuzzle shrew. Like a what? <laughs> oh, there he is. <laughs> That'll never get old. <laughs> Who taught you how to leap like a lerman, huh? <laughs> Was that his first word? A lerman? Me. Hello, Did Clone Wars know? reference. You taking on Boba Fett? Where is Boba Fett, by the way? I mean, I guess you know, he left Tatooine. <laughs> oh no, she's speaking Jawa again. I can really do without this. I think you should buy this beauty here. Damn. This R5 astromech is built for adventure. But you have no idea what that droid's been through. You are. R5D4 is as good as the day I came back from serving in the Rebellion. And yep. I'll reinstall your droid port, and yep. this little baby here can even co-pilot. R5's got quite a story. Oh, he is coming along! Come on now, don't be a coward. That's You're cool, a man. Like one. I thought you said it was built for adventure. <laughs> That's fun. It's nice to see Tatooine in a better place. You ready for an adventure? Man, that's so awesome. What a shot. I'm glad we didn't spend a lot of time on, on Tatooine, by the way. <laughs> I think we've all had enough Tatooine for a lifetime. Just a pit stop. I appreciate it. I grew up there on that moon. Concordia. Concordia. Yes. That's so cool. And that's Kalevala, where we visited Bo-Katan. A Mandalorian has to understand maps and know their way around. Live action Mandalores, freaking Concordia. Man. Man. Wow. Wow. My God. Completely cut off from the rest of the galaxy. Holy crap. Oh my god. Really is no saving this planet. I mean, I think that they really do have to move on from Mandalore itself. It wasn't a question. <laughs> Go over to that split in the rock. R5 is so gonna die at some point. Don't be a baby. Don't be a baby, dude. They're raiders. For all of R5's story, this would be such an anticlimactic end for him. Yep, <laughs> there he goes. R5, I'll pressurize my helmet. I appreciate the extra helmet lore. Don't worry, kid. I'll be right back. It's cool because Grogu can actually sense what he says. It's so freaking cool that Din Djarin's finally on Mandalore. Oh, there's Sindari! God. Yep. Here are the goblins, the raider goblin people. <laughs> Hello. Let's go. Oh, 
All right, come on, come on, Din. I think we can handle these guys. Yeah, I think we're good here. Holy crap. Bye, buddy. The amount of history in this city. Oh my god. It's gone and destroyed and everyone died, but it's so cool. Mandalore is not cursed. Well, I don't know what you're gonna do about the surface, man. I mean, we rebuild a new dome city, but... Ah, that's so cool! Please, walk into the throne room. Please! Please! I want to see the throne room. Please, we're here. Just take a stroll. Oh my god, this is where ATTEs. This is so freaking cool. Man, he's not going into the throne room. I'm sad. Come on, man. Come on, man. That's okay. That's okay. It, it makes sense. He wouldn't go looking for that. Man. Can we see like a downed Republic gunship or something? So, it, it just, you know, Clone Wars fan here. It's kind of a problem. Maybe we can see Pre Vistla's skull somewhere. No. Is there a Death Watch symbol on that helmet? Am I seeing things? I think I'm probably seeing things. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap! What is that? Oh. My. God. Dude. What? The hell? What the hell was that? What is this? It looks almost partially organic. It looks like Lotho Minor down here. Freaking Mandalorian graveyard. Damn dude, just rotisserie Mando. Is there a person in that? It's, it's, it's very disgusting. What the hell is that? That looks like the Star Wars equivalent of, of Alien versus Predator stuff. That's horrifyingly well done. All right, let's see if all that training with Luke paid off. But I would just cast the dark side we were inside, like it was just nothing. That is a horrifying creature. <laughs> oh no, Grogu. You got it, buddy. You got it. Get to bo -Katan. <laughs> Get to bo -Katan. Is he gonna hop back in that N1 and then... Oh, this is so cool! Yeah, because that's from the trailers, and he is gonna go get bo -Katan. And then that's how she joins him. Oh, that's so fun! Is that gonna happen this episode? Come on, dude. <laughs> there you go. Yo. Nice, there's that trailer moment. All right. All right, Grogu, R5. Get him to freaking Bo-Katan. Let's do it. Holy crap, dude. Come on, Droid, could you walk any slower? Your Majesty. Poor Bo really just sits there and broods all day, huh? Let's get rid of him once and for all. What? Chill out, Bo. What happened to him? Man, the new wig is so much better on her. It's ridiculous. <laughs> There's her starfighter dude live action again. That is so freaking cool. That is so freaking cool. Oh my god. This never gets old. This is so rad. There's the celebration shot. Live action. Okay, kid. I'm gonna need you to guide me to him. Can you do that? Bo-Katan. Back on Mandalore. I know I keep saying it, man, but this is, I mean, too freaking cool. <laughs> this is too freaking cool. Bo is definitely the one you want in this situation. She's gonna take that thing down. <laughs> this is so awesome. Oh 
what a shot. I did not think we- This was once a beautiful civilization. Ah. Oh. My family ruled it all. Now it's a tomb. Oh. Let's go. Oh my God. I didn't get to, I didn't think we'd get to see Bo in Sundari. Holy crap, dude. Holy crap. This is so cool. It's so depressing, but it's amazing. But I need you to guide me to him. <laughs> I knew quite a few Jedi, you know. Fought side by side. Yeah. How good are you with the Force? You must be quite good at it if you got back to me all alone. That was so cool. It was just the casual push. <laughs> oh man. Yup. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. Bo is not the one to mess with my ogre bros. Oh man. The freaking shield from the Clone Wars. Did you think your dad was the only Mandalorian? <laughs> oh God, it is jabbing him with toxins and stuff. I knew it. Is it siphoning blood from him? What? Dude, what the hell? What the hell is that, dude? Little force lightning baton. She's gonna pick up the dark saber. No, no! I wasn't ready for this. Hello, hello! Oh my god! I was not prepared. Hello? Are you okay? Oh my god! Can you hear me? Dude, this freaking thing. We just got to see Bo-Katan wield the freaking dark saber. Holy crap! It, it's a head. It can still. That's that's disgusting. Yeah, I can't hear you. Behind you. Oh my god! It got into its machine thing. Dude! Whoa! Whoa! Bo-Katan, dark saber wielding against a freaking boss. Hello? Hello? That was amazing! Oh my god! Holy crap! I might have to make an edit of that scene in Lego. That was too freaking cool! Mandalore is not cursed. Look around. There's nothing left. I once ruled here for a brief time. Now it's destroyed. Nothing to cling to but ashes. But there is nothing magic about the waters. Without the creed, what are we? What do we stand for? Our people are scattered like stars in the galaxy. The creed is how we survived. But I can't go with you until I fulfill my obligation. I will take you. To the living waters? Yes. Let's go. You'd never find them on your own. Let's go! Not in all this wreckage. Can we do it this episode or no? Yeah, dude, it looks like there's still a little time. It wasn't that long ago. You'd never know it looking at all this destruction. Oh my god. It looks like it's been centuries. Oh my god. It must pain you to see it like this after witnessing its beauty. What pains me is seeing our own kind fight one another time and time again. The entrance to the mines of Mandalore. They loved watching the princess recite the Mandalorian tenants as her father looked on proudly. Wow. Maybe he was proud. I know he was. I would have liked to have known him. He was a great man. He died defending Mandalore. This is the way. What are you looking at? <laughs> 
It's so cool to hear more of Bo's backstory, finally. According to ancient folklore, the mines were once a mythosaur lair. Yeah, dude, jump in. He is so riding a mythosaur by the end of this series. That's gonna be amazing. That's, oh my god. I swear on my name that I shall walk the way of the Mandalore, Cart. <laughs> of course, poor Bowman. She just has to dive. There's always something. My guy is trying to have a powerful moment of redemption to the watch. And there's just got to be something in every body of water in Star Wars. Ready to murder. Instantly. How far down did it drag him? That quick? What is it, dude? That's terrifying. What the hell took him that far? That quick! Thank God for the jetpack. Oh my God. Dude, is that a freaking mythosaur? Was that a freaking mythosaur? No way. Oh my god! Rachel Morrison, John Favreau, Dave Filoni! Holy crap! Thank you for that! Thank you for so much of that! That was... Uh, oh my god! That was astounding! I don't even think I need to reiterate how much I just loved everything we got to see. So much more of Bo-Katan live action, the capital city of Sundari bombarded, not even just 12 years earlier, if that, looking like it's centuries destroyed, now fully realized with Din Djarin and Katie Sackhoff in the armor walking its streets, the volume being really used properly. I mean, I could see where the volume was in a lot of the shots, but it was so much more seamless than what we've previously seen before. And so, I mean, that was just outstanding the robotic mechanical creature salvage machine thing was horrifying until Bo-Katan got there with the dark saber and the Mandalorian has been known for doing this to us right I mean Bo-Katan herself literally descended into the series out of nowhere last season and here she just returns to Sundari on a moment's notice and wields the dark saber all in live action with no warning it just happens and my inner lifelong Clone Wars fan was not prepared for any of this, and I, uh, <laughs> oh my god, Grogu being so much more capable too has been a joy to see. This has jo all just been an absolute joy to see. I really feel the need to update my Lego Bo-Katan with a better hairpiece now. I, I don't know when or how that will happen, but what I do know is this season, if this is only two of eight, is just gonna be an absolutely wild ride. Here I am thinking, oh yeah, we're gonna see Din Djarin ride a mythosaur by the end of the series, and then within this episode, they're like, here you go, live action mythosaur right down in the waters, it's right there, and it seems like that's gonna be the finale now without a shadow of a doubt to this season, never mind the future. So, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Dude, I really am also wondering if this will now be a sort of moment of a crisis in faith for Bo-Katan as well, because uh, she was standing at that podium, or I guess that plaque, just actively dismissing what it said. Uh, and then she went down there and saw a mythosaur herself. I mean, you see her exhale and the, the, the shock and the bubbles come from her helmet because she can't believe her eyes as she's... Dude, oh my God. Oh my God. As a lifelong Clone Wars fan, that was some of the most rewarding shit I've ever seen. Oh my god. I'm still holding out hope that we get to see the remains of the throne room because that's where shit really went down. Ah, uh, you know, I... <laughs> wow. Wow. 
Wow! And the references to the Clone Wars fighting side by side with other Jedi. Wow. Bravo. Bravo to everyone involved. My God. My God. Dude. Oh my God. Guys, let me know what you thought of The Mandalorian Chapter 18. Holy crap. Holy crap. I'll see you guys next week. I know this reaction was a little bit late, but I appreciate you sticking with me and hopefully uh, you enjoyed it to some extent. I'll see you next time. Uh, take care. May the force be with you and this is very much the way.